news from the region and from around the state, this is a Florida Focus Education Brief. Hello and welcome to Florida Focus. I'm Deanna Lowe. USF students earn more money after graduation. This is according to the 2016 College Scoreboard. USF graduates earn about $10,000 more a year than the national average. The Tampa campus is also $6,000 cheaper to attend than the average four-year university. Grades from the Department of Education are in for career training schools. Many Bay Area schools are failing. Reporter Dominique Whitehurst has the details. The U.S. Department of Education says career training programs have unmanageable debt-to-earning ratios. This means post-grad salaries aren't high enough for students to pay back their student loans. These numbers are based on landmark gainful employment regulations. Sanford Brown College is one of the 18 area schools of the Department of Education's failing list. Bay Area programs on this list range from hairstyling to graphic design. The goal of the report is to encourage accountability in post-secondary education. Reporting from Photo Focus, I'm Dominique Whitehurst. Pasco County wants to become home to a new statewide forensics lab. Plans for this center include giving resources to law enforcement, medical examiners, and students. It will provide training for investigating cases like homicide and human trafficking. It would also be a working crime lab. The project must be approved by the Florida Legislature. A Pasco County school is one step closer to having its own performing arts center. Pasco Hernando State College entered into an agreement with Pasco County School District to build the center. It will be located at New Cypress Creek Middle High School. The center will focus on performing arts and education. That's all that we have for Florida Focus. Thank you for watching.